This week, we released several titles and updates across the MetaQuest platform. Here's a rundown of the highlights. Jupiter Grad 2, The Lost Station Jupiter Grad 2, The Lost Station is a standalone sequel to the highly acclaimed Jupiter Grad, known for its satisfying movement system and twisted, Slavic humor. Sounds cool? Well, here's part 2. And you don't even have to know the original to enjoy the sequel. Perfect for fans of Jupiter Grad, Swarm, and the Metroidvania genre. From home, cosmonaut. Synth Riders, Synthwave Essentials 3 Music Pack. Synth Riders goes back to the synths to celebrate five years of riding the rails with the Synthwave Essentials 3 Music Pack. Headlined by The Midnight, this 10-song pack, 5 free songs, 5 paid DLC, also features a brand new cover of New Order's classic Blue Monday, created just for synth riders by legendary DJ Zardonet. Also in the pack are tracks and remixes featuring Starcadian, Go SD, Ollie Ride, Dance with the Dead, Scandroid, LeBrock, and Prism. Battle Bows. Ready, aim, pop. In a far-off land in a distant realm, Infladium is the source of all life. Those born there are living, breathing balloons. Their reserves have been depleted thanks to years of thoughtless use, leaving them scraping to survive. Much to your realm's terror, their scouts have found pockets of Infladium in your realm. Now, their armies are pouring into your world, unleashing creatures whose evolution has taken a different, deadlier turn. Band together with other archers to defend your realm's Infladium from terrifyingly zany living balloons. Perfect for aspiring archers and fans of tower defense games. Operation Wolf Returns, First Mission VR. The iconic action rail shooter comes back in VR. Released in arcades back in 1987, Operation Wolf Returns, First Mission VR adopts the same DNA as in the original game with a design rehaul. A few months ago, a new criminal organization made its debut appearance. In addition to trafficking arms and drugs, it's developed a new, super-powerful weapon. After discovering several bases of the organization, led by the mysterious General Viper, two agents are dispatched to learn more about this weapon and free the hostages held in the surrounding camps. Perfect for fans of B-Team, ARK and Ade, and Wings 1941. Breachers, Control Point Update In Control Point, Enforcers and Revolters have access to the exact same weapons and gadgets, while both teams will fight to hold designated rooms to gain points. This game mode will be playable on Factory, Hideout, and Skyscraper, as well as on the new map the devs are still working on for a future update. Perfect for fans of Hyper Dash, Broken Edge, and Everslot Invasion. He's going for the EMP. Don't let him through. Planning now, cover me. Running out of time, take him out. Oh, out. Almost there. Creeman, Mercenary Tales, a tale of 100 deeds update. Creeman, Mercenary Tales is all about amazing deeds and exaggerated achievements. After all, each of the eight adventurers you'll take on the role of is vying for the title of greatest hero of the era. If only there were a way to reflect their, er, your unbelievable accomplishments with some kind of badges or tokens. Wait a second, that's, light bulb, from now on, all your significant actions and deeds will be rewarded with through the brand new, totally awesome, and hellishly demanding cream and achievement system. Beware though, as the road ahead is long and bumpy. There are as many as 100 achievements to unlock. The update also includes new power-ups, a reverse weapon grip, more gameplay settings, and quality of life changes. Perfect for fans of Chaucer, The Wizards, and Warhammer Age of Sigmar, Tempestfall.
Barbaria, Age of Expression Update. The Age of Retribution has ended and the Age of Expression begins. The devs have added 6 new structures, a new item type, fragment caps, friendly attack replays, and lots of new customization options so you can expand your realms and make them uniquely your own. Perfect for fans of Gorn, Knockout League, and Brass Tactics. There's only one rule! Yours! Welcome to Bavaria! Dyschronia, Kronos Alternate, Episode 3, End of Hallucinations. The clock strikes midnight, and Hal returns to Ostrom close on the brink of destruction. With the help of Maya, who has awoken from her slumber, he lays out his plans to stop the appalling incident at the Bureau. The city sinks into illusion, and the boundary between dream and reality fades. As the clock tower door opens and the truth of 12 years ago is unveiled, the time for final judgment arrives. You must play through episodes 1 and 2 to be able to play episode 3. Perfect for fans of interactive visual novels and anime, Tokyo Chronos, and Aldeus, Beyond Chronos. Dyschronia, Chronos Alternate.